Hey, wait. Where did everybody go? I thought we were all going to go see the castle. Oh well, looks like I'm going alone. <laughs> Hey, where am I? Oh no, I think I'm lost. Hey lady, which way to the castle? That way? Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Your friends went on ahead. They said they'd wait for you. All my life, been grinding all my life. Sacrifice, hustle paid the price. Want a slice, got to roll the dice. That's why, all my life, I've been grinding all my life. Look, all my life, been grinding all my life. Sacrifice, hustle paid the price. Want a slice, got to roll the dice. That's why, all my life, I've been grinding all my life. Shalom, shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all glory and praises to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahusha, Bashim, and Hapadash, the divine to the apostles, and the elders of Great Millstone, and the citations to Oprah Lake, pushing his word to sincerity. This is the brother to Wabakah from GMS LA slash LA Empire. Coming back with another video of the spirit, free workout. You know, I want to, I want to um, go into, which is a topic we always go into, but I mean, I mean, can't speak on it enough. It's um, where your affection should be. Saying like, because this this world, this present society we in, this is not our rest. Okay, yeah, we do we do what we have to do, you know. In the, in the meanwhile, you know, as far as taking care of our families, taking care of our households, things of that nature. But as far as to be invested into this place, you know, that's not the, the, the spirit of being. You know, you got a lot of these Israelite camps out here. Their mindset is of, of being in this place forever. You know, we, a lot of these, we believe a lot of these camps sold out. They took the bag because they don't, they, they really believe that, they don't believe in their heart, in their heart, you know what I'm saying, that this place is going to, um, it's going to be destroyed. You know what I'm saying? But us brothers that's in this faith, that's really in this fight, you know what I'm saying, that's really, uh, in the, uh, like I said, in this fight, we, we, we pray uh, every day, we hasten the day that the Lord come and destroy this place, man, and deliver it. We, we 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 know that as long as we under this in this society, we we'll, we will never have peace. We'll never have true uh, peace and, and joy. You know. So with that, I'm, uh, I'm gonna get right into it. And I'm you know I pray this is edifying to you, uh, your brother out there. All right. It says uh, this is Colossians three and one. It says if you then be risen with Hamashiach Yahushai, seek those things which are above, where Yahushai sitteth on the right hand of the Most High. So we supposed to seek things. That's above, okay? Yeah, you know, brothers get blessings, you know, currently from time to time, but that's not we don't we don't set our heart into that, you know, right? That's not where our um our passion lies, okay? Our passion is, is is in this truth, you know what I'm saying? Because we we understand, like I said, um, in the opening of the video, we'll never have true peace and joy and prosperity here as long as we as long as we are in, in our captivity. All right, it says, uh, set your affection on things above, not on things on the earth, for ye are dead and your life is hid. Our life is hid in the Lord. You know what I'm saying? That's why, uh, you know, we're not renowned in this world, okay? People walk by, and when people see us, they, they like, who the fuck, the fuck is these guys, you know? You know, that's the, that when they see us out there teaching, like, we, like this girl saying, man, when the poor man speaking, they said, what fellow is this? Who's this nigga? You know? Like, why, why is he talking in, in this? In, like, who gave you the authority, yes, sir? You know? Who gave you the authority? That's what they say. You know? Not realizing that the one who they eagerly call God and the one who, who they eagerly call Jesus Christ, that we're, we're coming in their spirit. You know? We're, we're the mouthpiece of the Lord. Right? It says... 
Set your affection on things above, now on things on the earth, for you are dead and your life is hid. Yahweh Bashi now shy. When Yahweh shy, who is our life, shall appear, then shall he also appear with him in glory. See, when our Lord appears, that's when that's when it's gonna be the time for uh, our, uh, our glory. Lord willing to be those men. You know, because it's gonna start with the Lord. The Lord gotta get his glory first. Because the, the world, the world is not uh giving honor to the to the Lord, to the true Lord. Okay, because everybody's uh they, they're um stuck so stupid from that, that image, you know, that image of, of, of the Lord being a so-called white man, you know. But when you people will open up your Bible and read in Revelation, the first chapter, 13th verse, it gives you the true description of the one who we call Jesus Christ. And that description is of, 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 is of him being the so-called black man, okay? So this scripture. This is going to tie into the scripture I just brought out. This is Micah, chapter 2, verse 10. It says, Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted. It shall destroy you even with a sure destruction. Right. Because we're supposed to, we're supposed to come out of the mentality. Because, you know, when you come into this truth, everything's supposed to change. Your, your mindset supposed to change. Your creep, you got to change, man. Everything, your health, everything. You know, you got to become that new man, that new creature, you know, and that starts in the mind, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and also uh, uh, separating from this world, separating from the, the you know, the, the minds of the people in this world. Because the, the reason why the, the majority of our people are out here bugged out is because they're, they're, they're they have the spirit of the world on them. You know, they're attached to this world. The, the lies, the deception, okay, the so-called currency. All these things out here is totally uh, blinded our people from, from, I mean, ultimately it's the Lord. Those things play a factor in why a lot of our people don't take you to this word, man. It's true. Because they, they, they're attached to the world. You know, they, if they like, like Yahweh Shai said it best in John the 16th chapter, he said, if you were of the world, the world would hear his own. But since you are not of the world, they don't hear you. You know, they don't receive you. Because he said the world hated me before it hated you. You know, so that's why the majority of these people out here, they look at us crazy, you know, even when we out and about, you know, they, they uh, you know, when you go to a store or whatever, you got certain people that give you that evil look, it's because they know they, that your, your spirit, that, that this, this, this thing is a spiritual thing, man, that's the demon, you know, they know who, 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 who's, uh, who's in this thing and who ain't in this thing, man. I'm going to get one more and I'm going to wrap it up. scriptures we all know but you can never hear these scriptures but it's a reason why the Lord repeats himself man we always got to keep these, these words at the forefront of our mind you know just like when you was a child your parents used to tell you certain things thousands of times over and over again you know the Lord is the same way he's the ultimate he's the ultimate uh, parent all right it says this is first John 2 and 15 it says love not the world neither the things that are in the world if any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. So if you see a guy teaching lies, deception, he's not, the love of the Lord is not in him because he's trying to appease the world. See, that's another thing why these, 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 uh, these camps push these false doctrines because they want to appease the world. They want to fit in with everybody. They don't want to have that. They don't want to ruffle no feathers. They don't want to be looked at as an outcast, you know? And that, that's going to get a lot, uh, a lot of individuals individuals destroyed because the Lord's not dealing with that man so what the hell you 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 gonna you gonna lie you gonna you gonna take the Lord's word and you gonna you gonna put lies on it just so you can fit in only for the Lord to come back and destroy you you know that's how foolish uh the majority of our people become man it says love not the world neither the things are anywhere and that goes for everything man because this world what does this world uphold it upholds wickedness you know especially out here with this you know, pedophilia, you know, all that, that shit is, is, is running rampant out here, man. You know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta have a serious demon on you if you, you okay with this shit out here, man. All right, it says, for all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh, and the lust of, eye, of the eyes, and the pride of life is not of the Father, but it's of the world. See, that's of the world. And we're not supposed to be of this world, man. We're supposed to condemn this world, man. We ain't, we ain't supposed to be out here uplifting this. Yes, all here, man. You know, just for the sake of 
getting pats on the back and high fives and all that other type of shit, man. Fuck all that, man. They ain't, if you ain't teaching this word the, the, the correct way, 100% way, God by Shmuel Shah is not dealing with you, man. Plain and simple. So with that, I'm going to wrap it up. I'm going to leave this some edifying to the brothers out there. Shalom.